So my thing with Capital Hoops was I wanted to be able to create like an experience for people that didn't come to the game. I wanted them to be able to go on the computer, look at my content, and basically they'd be just as informed about what happened that night as the guy who was at the game. So at the barber shop or the water cooler the next day, if people were talking about a game, if you dialed into Capital Hoops, like you knew just as much as the guy who was there. That was kind of my vision from day one, right? So you see a lot of people doing short highlight tapes. And even these days with like Instagram and Twitter, you see 30 second minute longs and that seems to be the norm these days. But for me, I never deviated on that. I always wanted to keep it long because I wanted, my, my thing is not, is not just like an entertainment thing. My thing is to help kids get recruited, to help kids get scholarship, to give kids exposure. And yes, if I show someone dunk on someone, it's going to get a lot of clicks and everyone's going to be excited about it. But like a college coach is never going to watch a highlight tape of someone dunking on someone and being like, I want that kid on my team. And that was where I saw where I provided value is I give the college coaches that don't want to come to DC to see a kid an opportunity to see him through my platform. I'm proud, I shoot,